क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी वन से इज दट द करेंट इन आइडल पी एन जंक्शन डायोड शोन इन सर्किट इज नाउ डी स्टूडेंट्स दिस पर्टिकुलर डायोड इज फोर्वर्ड बायस्ड एंड हेंस द करंट थ्रू दिस डायोड विल बी इक्वल टू थ्री माइनस वन डिवाइड बाय रेजिस्टेंस दैट इज हंड्रेड दैट इज टू बाय हंड्रेड और ट्वेंटी मिली एम्प्योर विच मेक्स द ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री एज द करेक्ट आंसर Now let us proceed to the question number forty-two. Question number forty-two says a Zener diode of breakdown voltage V Z is equal to ten volt is used in the circuit given below. The current through the Zener diode is. Dear students, when the Zener diode exhibits conduction, then the potential difference across it is the breakdown voltage, and hence a voltage of 30 volt minus breakdown voltage that is 10 volt which will be equal to 20 volt will be acting across the 500 ohm resistor the current through the 500 ohm resistor therefore would be 20 divided by 500 that is it will be equal to 0.04 ampere or 40 milli ampere dear students In this particular question, since the potential difference across the Zener diode is 10 volt, similarly a potential difference of 10 volt will be across 1 kilo ohm resistor, and the current I2 across the 1 kilo ohm resistor would be 10 divided by 10 raised to power 3, that is 1 kilo ohm resistance, which will be equal to 10 milli ampere. Dear students, the remaining current. Which will be equal to I minus I two, that is forty minus ten, that is thirty milli ampere, would flow across this Zener diode, and hence the correct answer for this question is option number two. Dear students, let us proceed to the question number forty three. Question number forty three says combination of following gates behave as. Dear students, to solve this question. let us draw the truth table for this particular combination of logic gates when a is 0 and b is 0 y has an output 1 while when a is 1 b is 0 y has an output 0 when a is 0 b is 1 y has an output 0 while a is 1 b is 1 y has an output 0 this truth table corresponds to the nor gate and hence the correct answer for this question is option number 2 dear students let us proceed to the question number 44 question number 44 says the number of alpha particles and beta particles respectively emitted in the reaction 92 u238 gives 82 pb206 r dear students we must know that in alpha decay the mass number decreases by 4 while in beta decay the mass number is unchanged now the students in this particular question the total change in mass number is 238 minus 206 now this will be equal to 32 dear students let us assume that therefore we can write that n into 4 is equal to 32 which means that n is equal to 8 therefore dear students the number of alpha decays happening in this particular reaction are 8 the number of beta decays R six, and as the correct answer for this question should be option number one. Dear students, let us proceed to the question number forty-five. Question number forty-five says choose the correct answer regarding base region in bipolar junction transistor. Dear students, the base in bipolar junction transition. Dear students. the base region in bipolar junction transistor is lightly doped and thin 
It is a fairly theoretical question and the correct answer for this question is option number 2. Dear student, this concludes the discussions on the quick solutions of this test. I wish you all the best. Thank you for watching and God bless you.